All right, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to another episode on the Vape Train Gaming Channel. So, are you ready to go search in the Fro Zone? Oh, I am. Let's get it started. All right, ladies and gentlemen, so we are here on the ERKSurvivalism.com server cluster thing, so definitely come join me. Um, Trying to get more people on here, but we're gonna do the searching the Frozone um, mission. So this is going to be a search and hunt mission or search mission. It's over here at seventy twenty six. Now this one is going to be interesting because I haven't done it before, and y'all are here for the first time. But um, best way to get here is by doing the biome teleport to north and it'll take you right down there next to the fishing lake and it has the fishing mission on there as well but so we're gonna go do this one and i think it really just has me going through this cave so let's get this started shall we so this one takes you to little shiny points where you pick up the little shiny points and apparently i've heard this cave is ridiculously um violent because all of the bears in here are just angry. Like, so horribly angry. So we've got to work on clearing these out. And this is also the cave where you can tame Feroxes at. You see little Feroxes running around all throughout here. So keep that in mind if you ever want to tame a Ferox. You'll be able to get some in here. Clear out the bears. Bears must die. Okay. Where is the shiny point? Can I get my Rex through this? I don't think I can. That's not good at all. Alright, we're gonna get out, dismount. Hope we don't end up getting taken out by some bears. Make sure this guy didn't have anything valuable in his inventory. Oh, hello, little Ferox. Alright keep him ready to be deployed. I like run past it? That way. Flag. There we go. Alright. So this is the Oasis. It's a super pretty place. It's full of Feroxes and angry bears, so keep that in mind as well. So that one is in... Are oh, they in the water down here? Asking for me to die, isn't it? Go down here. If I had known this, I would have brought some scuba slippers. Rex, as long as you can handle those for right now, we'll be alright. There's a spot in the center over here. Well, take care of the bear. And apparently a 130 Ferox, which makes me sad. Because you know what? I haven't even, like, I tried taming a Ferox the other day. And while I was doing it, uh, people came in to actually uh, <laughs> help me clear out the bears. And the bears uh, were not the issue at the time. I was in the middle of taming a max tame Ferox, and they accidentally killed it. And I was like, you just lost me like five element. You suck. All right, so on to Zeg, the next region. Ein. Sorry, guys. Ein was getting overly excited. Let's run to the next region. Go, go, go. Ein.
All right, folks, we're to the next zone, which is called Under the Ice, um, which is not very reassuring to me because I feel like I'm going to die underneath the water here. Yep. So, apparently, best thing I can tell you, bring some scuba gear because a lot of this stuff will go underwater. You don't need to take a chance of dying because of it. Just don't hit any of the salmon in here because you will highly regret it. Still have my Rex on me, watching my oxygen. I don't want to die in the cold lake water, but I'm gonna make sure to get everything here. Um, honestly, I think if you had a really good, like, bread set of uh, dire bears, I think you would actually be able to do this like really easy, because you can go through that cave without having to worry about anything, and yeah. That actually would work out really well. Instead of being like me, getting attacked by things. Leave me alone. No. I don't feel like dying here. Oh, now you're after me again? That's not cool. Not cool, dude. Now you're gonna have to die. All right, guys, so we're going to run on to the next zone. So the way these missions work is they basically want you to gather points in each zone, and then you just gather it all. So we're going to go do that. Where is this next region? It's that way. I feel like they could have planned this out a little bit better. I mean, instead of starting me off at the little cave and then running me down the side and then have me run back up this way. But we'll get there. folks so we're at a place called the thawed waterway um let's see is it all gonna be in the lake over here too no i don't see anything okay so follow the green stuff this way i'm gonna go around this way this is where i like to come and fish for uh, fish meat for raising dinos that you know only eat fish meat I'll bring a Rex or anything into that pond right there and just clear it out. And it's like thousands upon thousands of fish meat. It's pretty great. Okay, why is it red this direction? But it's not that. Oh, there it is. Oh yeah, a really good bread dire bear would probably be great in this situation. Don't throw poop at me, Beanie. Oh, that was 145 too, that's a shame. I actually really like calicotheriums. They're like other versions of uh, freaking rock golems, except not rock golems. And you passive tame them with beer. So they're drunk don donkeys. Donkey! And of course, be very wary of the UDs around here. Seriously? I was just talking about you. You fall off of a mountain. You are not a very high level one, so I don't really have to worry about you. Okay, so we're gonna keep going this way. Where are some shiny stuffs? Shiny stuffs, where are you? There's another shiny. 
Now, each one of these zones has a time limit. Um, so every time you gather all the points, it eventually will tell you that you have X amount of time to get to the next zone. So it's it's interesting, to say the least. One more this way somewhere. I wonder... Oh, I completed that region. Okay, where is this one? I have to go to the eastern slopes. So, let's get there. It's going to take a bit. It's, you know, over a thousand meters away, so it's going to be a little bit. I'll be right back. Alright folks, we made it to the southern slopes. I did not exactly know the best route to get here, so I kind of like improvised. So, I'm here. I'm just in the middle of a snowstorm, and I hate the snowstorms in this zone, because I can't see jack. Like, I can barely even tell that there's a wall right next to me. Like, it's that bad. Do I have to be up top? I think I do. How do I get up top? I can't see. Being stuck in this is not great. Oh, there's a rock element. Okay, so I think I can go up this way and get up top. Even though this is all ridiculously horrible. If anybody has a trick for getting rid of this, uh, please let me know in the comment section below because this is ridiculous. Like, I, I can't see anything. And it's driving me crazy. Okay, green this way. Oh, there's one. Oh, well. 
Yeah. Gather that. Fine! Enough! Enough! Enough. No. Okay, so let's go this way. Sorry about that, guys. Mine was getting a little excited because he heard noises outside the door. We live in an apartment, so of course, he's going to hear noises all the time. Green this way up. There it is. Hidden in the woods. Go grab that real quick. Ugh, I'm running low on time. Come on, turn around. That way. Running really low on time. That's not good at all. Fine. Enough. Yeah, I would really like to know a trick to take care of this stuff. You know what, wolves? Y'all are doing a good job. Beat them up. I need to go this way anyways. <gasps> there it is. There's the other one. You still after me? And wolves, I'm going to have to kill y'all too. Because y'all are going to come after me when I go after this. One more. One more. That way. Alright, wolves. F off, dude. Last one's over here. Seriously? Yeah, you might want to turn off your uh, gathering. It's up to you. I just haven't do been doing any like inventory maintenance so this should be the last one we did it yes aha so downfall about these uh these missions is they first off they really don't give that much hexagons um so they only give let's see frozone they only give 125 because literally all you're doing is you're just running around and collecting these little glowing orbs that are like showing you like key points in this biome right um, but let's check out loot I got. Um, more desert armor. Uh, we got chitin. Ooh, a giga saddle. You might actually want to farm that then. Uh, plesio saddles, uh, procoptodon, the giant, you know, kangaroos, uh, raptor saddles, thylacolia, more procoptodon. There's scuba headsets or scuba masks. That's always good. Of course, glow sticks and all the edibles. Um, some cloth armor, uh, some stone tools. But yeah, guys, so that's, uh, that's searching the Frozone, guys. And, uh, yeah, y'all make sure to come back and see me again. I'm trying to make sure I can constantly still be putting out videos, but there's a lot of stuff going on in life, so I'm kind of missing out, and there's been a, I've been working a lot. It's been doing all this other stuff, but thank you guys for coming in. Thank you for being my viewers and everything and for those of you who are not normal viewers please by all means smash the like button hit the sub button i would love to have y'all be a part of it we are a little under 70 away from 1000 subscribers one of my biggest goals for this year is to hit a thousand subscribers so if you can share the video up do everything you can smash that sub button and be a part of it yourself but y'all come back and see me again i'll catch you next time and remember keep on surviving